Welcome back. <laughs> Do like you did up there at the beginning, you know, when we were standing in the doorway and you said, Hello! <laughs> Good afternoon! <laughs> okay. Welcome to this rendition of Messy Meddlers. Yes. That's it. Okay. Okay. <clears throat> well, it's a new day. We um, got this wall up yesterday. Now <laughs> it's a new day and we're back up here. We need to start on this section of the wall because it has to be put in next before we put that in because it needs to lay out there. We just need the room. But then there's a big pile of scrap there. And some of it's not scrap, but some of it is. And it at least needs out of here and stored somewhere other than in this room right now. So uh, we're going to spend some time cleaning up this mess. It's hard to work when you have a mess around. I it just is. can't do it. I have to have a clean area to mess up again. <laughs> yeah, that's true. I like helping with that part. Okay. I guess we'll get at it then. was my old dustpan. Upgrade to this. Poor people have poor ways. I noticed that I'm, I get to talking and I, I 
get in front of you and stuff, so that's not That's good. okay. I don't no, need to not. be in it. Yes, you do. Yes, you do. <laughs> it's a must. It's a must-have. <clears throat> we made it back up here today. Uh, I believe we left off on this wall. We had run out of some studs to finish it out, so half of this didn't get stood up last week. That was, uh, we built part of it Saturday and then part of it Sunday evening. We coming back and cleaned up. So this is the following Saturday. We're back up here. Um, and we got some more lumber to finish this wall out. Um, some more tuba sixes. Also got these uh, long 16 foot boards here. And that's to go up here. They'll reach from there all the way to that end. And we'll sandwich that whatever you want to call that, their beam. Uh, we're going to rework it, level it up, and rework it a little bit and put one of them on either side. They'll split here and then we'll take another board and go from there and set just beyond where that header's at so it's got uh, all that extra support all the way through. So it should be a lot better. Uh, but today we're going to get this wall finished out. <clears throat> I had it laid out for two foot centers on studs and I think I'm going to change that to 16 just so the sheet rock and all will be straighter and uh, accept the cabinets a little better and, and may not be um, any voids behind them in between the cabinet and the sheet rock is bad. Uh, I don't think it needs it for the strength considering it's an interior wall that way but uh, I think that's what I'm going to do. I, I did that last week because I was actually knew that I was going to be running short on studs so I was trying to stretch my lumber but I'll, I will change these out a little later but today we're going to finish that and get that stripped down up there to where we can see that and uh, get it leveled back up where it's supposed to be and then hopefully uh, we can get those boards up there and uh, attached and screwed together. We've got some long screws that'll go all the way through the both of those boards plus what's up there. So hopefully it'll tie it all together and make it good and tight and, and a lot more structurally sound. So what do you got to say about that doll? Good plan. You ready to get at it? Ready to go. Okay, here we go. Okay.
crotches will undress a fella. Okay, so here we are up here by this beam. This is what we just put in. Uh, it's got that doing pretty good down through there. However, you turn this way, and this is what we've got over here. I think if you can see that, it's got a pretty significant swag there in the middle. So um, we're going to try to get it up there in a little better shape. I don't know this. This wall's all coming out, as I think we told you last time, so we wanted to get room to work here and see what was going on. So anyhow, we got that out of there. All cleaned up, that bottom board is coming off. We'll get it off. That little spot right there is a mouse hole. And there's mouse hair in it and a pile of mouse hair on the bottom of that little ledge and there was a little baby dead mouse up there too a little bitty guy he met his demise up there somehow anyhow that's kind of where we're at and i think the next step here is to get some jacks in here and get it set up here and get this uh, squared up you know, or straight or whatever you want to call it. Uh, that's the plan at the moment. You got any plans, doll? I do whatever you tell me to do. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Okay.
right, so that is, what did I raise at least? An inch and a quarter, didn't I? Or maybe an inch more than that. Inch and a quarter. That looks pretty good there. Anyway, that's what we're going to go with. <laughs> what? <laughs> I'm trying to be serious and get something done here, and that's what I have to deal with. Sight down with this while you're up there. Look better? Yep.
big fat head anyway. Yeah, he went back down. Yeah, I want to say about three eighths of an inch or so. But that is a lot better than it was. It still has a little low spot right there, but in comparison to what it was, it's not bad at all. And that it's bound to be a lot better than it was. Mm -hmm. So let me run that all the way over to this header here. So that board's sitting on it. So it's all got extra support all the way through the the amount of two tuba sixes so extra so i guess we'll see for now we're not we're wanting to leave this open so i don't know we might decide to do something a little different there but honestly on a what is this place how old is it 20 30 37 years 37 old. 37 years old. 37 year old place, and I think that's probably got about three eighths of an inch of a sag, according to just sighting down it. So, and it had over an inch to start with. Inch, I think it was close to an inch and a half. So, I don't know. I have a fairly high tolerance for stuff like that. Some people do not, and that's okay. But that's the difference between this place being affordable to fix and not when you go to worrying about a little bit like that. So, and it's not going anywhere. So, what do you think, Lise? We're going to clean up around here a little bit. And yeah, I think so. I think one of the next things we do, we've we'll probably take this little area out right here uh not today but all this is so we've, we're getting ourselves pinned in here so uh, this this whole deal here is going to come out and that'll open this up for now and this could possibly go away too the rest of this wall wanted it out of the way today just to get up there for one thing but uh get that closet out there and then when we was that far we just wanted to see a open spot through there so that's what we did all righty well we do appreciate you we've had a, several people subscribe in the last couple of weeks a few hundred so we're yeah. very thankful for that and we appreciate you we appreciate all of our subscribers and the people who uh, want to make uh, comments. We appreciate those. They've been good comments and we do read them all and we appreciate it. So, and we'll try to reply as we have time. But like I say, we do work uh, full-time jobs and then have another place we're working on in this. So uh, we stay fairly busy. So anyhow, we're going to get out of here. We appreciate you spending some time with us and we'll see you at least next Thursday, maybe. Yeah. See hey. ya. Thank you.